Hello, people. I'm Vito, and welcome back to Path of Radiance with Robberlink. Hello. All right, so where we left off, we beat up Patrine. She's gone now, and now we have to meet up with Jeffrey at Delbray Castle. Yes. So there is one thing I wanted to check real quick. I saw last time between episodes that even if I give Soth enough bonus experience to get to level 20, he can't class up. But I was wondering, if I were to remove Blossom, would that let him? So what I can do is, without saving, I could just remove that, then give him from the convoy a Master Seal. Whoops, no, take. And then see if we can use the... Nope. Okay. Hmm. All right, restarting. So it said that in the unit this uh, status and whatnot that um there's conversations to be had with Jeffrey with Ike and Kieran. So I think maybe I should take Kieran for that reason, even though he's massively on under level. So we're having our very own escort mission, <laughs> except it's going to be okay because we can actually control the escort. Yes. But yeah, for the most part, I think I have everyone who I want. Also, I realized that, um, here, Mist, because she can now use swords and she has magic as her specialty, she could use a sonic sword. Oh, you're right. And she would do really well with that. The thing is, it's a B level. Ah. And she's D. So I need her to get a lot more weapon experience before she can actually use a sonic sword, but that would hurt so much you may want to use arm scrolls just one at least yeah because she's still i assume going to be healing as well yeah all right so i think i'm good these crimean refugees are no easy meat and there are more of them than i expected hmm oh there's a lot more than you expected i assure you <laughs> coming from behind G general ricard enemy reinforcements are approaching from the east what it appears to be troops from Princess Crimea's army. The army that brushed aside our troops in Dayan and defeated General Petrine at the Riven Bridge? They're marching towards us. Fantastic. I was getting bored hunting stragglers. Let's smash all of these curves and... Curves. <laughs> Sorry, let me try again. Let's smash all of these curves and wrap ourselves in glory. <laughs> Biting off a little more than you can chew, eh? General Jeffrey, it's the Crimean army. Princess Alencia's army is headed this way. The princess's army? The one that wiped out Petrine at the Riven Bridge? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that army. Fools. Let's meet up th with them and wrap ourselves in glory. <laughs> Fools. What are you thinking, Bastion? Oh, princess, it's not too late. Please take wing and flee. Our goal here is to rescue those knights near the castle. Attack. So I believe it said I only have 15 turns. Oh, I didn't notice. Okay. Hello, people. Ready to die? Too bad you're dying anyway. So there's... Oh, a killer. Lance. Silver Lance. So I think I've mentioned this at one point before, but... I think it'd be interesting to see if... Um, you just focused only on, like, cavalry units. <laughs> and, uh, just see how... What you can do with that. Because eventually you do get quite a few. Yeah. Like, we also have Magalov and Astrid. And Astrid would be really easy to level up because she has Paragon. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Alright, you won't even... What does that do again? Paragon gives double XP. Right. And that is for any XP, be it in combat or bonus. So she takes half as much bonus XP to level up. So I could get her classed up in no time. All right. Heavy sword first, I suppose. Hmm. These guys are getting good. Imagine this big, heavy, plated knight just thumping towards you. <laughs> and you only have a 40% chance of hitting him. <laughs> Well, he managed, but it didn't do a whole lot. Hmm. Yeah, you won't kill him either. Hmm. 
Gosh dang it. Stop having so much health. I wonder if because of how much I've been focusing on getting everyone up to speed that I wanted, I wonder if I'm supposed to be having people that are much higher level than this. Probably not much higher, just like a few levels, I'd assume. What level is he? He's 15. Yeah, I don't know. That would kill him. You know what? Hold on. What's... Okay, you're at four. And what's your ranges? Okay, then maybe... Yes. Hmm. You can get that experience. You don't need that. Zap him to death. Zap, zap, zap. But they said be nice today. Actually, well, it was raining earlier already. And there was a tornado somewhat nearby, but that's not important. Oh, you're talking about real life? Oh, you weren't? <laughs> Remember uh, Jeffrey said, you know, what a terrible day for rain? Right, I forgot. <laughs> that was... <laughs> <laughs> Are we talking about the same thing? <laughs> Apparently not. Uh. Yes, the tornado came to congratulate us. The princess's... Cry Princess Crimea's army that defeated Jarrow Brigade at the Riven Bridge. <laughs> if the storm comes now, it can wrap itself in glory. <laughs> it's like the dumbest thing to <laughs> it is. have as a recurring quote or whatever. <laughs> I think we could make it work. I suppose so. I, d I helped defeat Gerald Petrine at the Riven Bridge, and all I got was this cool t-shirt and got wrapped up in glory. <laughs> oh my god, you have one resistance. <laughs> Let's uh, keep him away from the mages. Are there any mages? If there are, he won't be seeing them. Okay, there's... Okay. Oh. oh god. <laughs> okay, keep him away from that guy. I'll do 23 damage in one shot. Oh, looks like that's it, though. Yeah, so it's it's actually incredibly safe for uh, Brahmin Gatry, then. Uh, what's your defense? Ten. Dang, these, these guys will probably hurt quite a bit. Yeah. So maybe I could leave them in range of one of them, but not the other. Is that in range of these guys, though? I think it might be, I don't know. I might have to actually count this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, then you might be safe here-ish? Hold Good. on. Or can he just fly over that? As I'll say, can he fly? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, then he wouldn't be safe there. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I should stop wasting time worrying about that and then just uh, leave him in a safe place for now. You can also block off one side of him. I guess. Um, and then leave him barely in range. Yeah, but that's kind of a chore. Hold on. Um, well, so's doing this meticulous mathematics. That's why of... I was. That's why I was going to stop. <laughs> but I mean, if you if you say it's a good idea, then now don't go putting words in my mouth. Okay, then I won't. Jeez. <laughs> All right, your ranges again, please. Okay. I'm wondering, does Mist have better defense than him? No. I was going to say, if Mist has better defense, then you really <laughs> suck. go first. You still can't reach. Fine. <laughs> I should probably also consider who I want to go where. Um, probably. Because there's... I, I usually do that, except I haven't been telling you to because, you know, 
Time constraints. Yeah. Because I want to go after Ricard with some people in that house, and then the art house with the art people. Uh, you can go after Ricard, so... we Charge! Yeah, that's good, so... Squiggly line, for no reason. I think Nephni and Ike would probably be enough for one for one way altogether. Probably. And then I guess Mist should actually probably go with them because Ileana can heal everyone else on the other side. True. Wait, who haven't I moved? Oh yeah, Brom again. That's right, you still can't reach. Yeah, he is so dark, it's like, wait. It looks like everyone's already moved. That's my issue with uh, Ileana, honestly. <laughs> Ow. Okay, note to self, I need to get there fast. Meh. I think you had better targets because he has a lance. <laughs> you literally can't do damage, why? His choice. I mean, I'm sure he didn't have a good chance of hitting Marsha, but still. Okay, come with your silver lance. Actually, it looks pretty cool. Ouch. You still suck. Even if you hurt. That's probably the most uh, damage Ike's taken in one hit in a long time. Yeah, I don't, I don't even think Petrine did that much. <laughs> no, my experience! Oh yeah, because, you know... You should only be able to get to them by this turn already. Yeah. Nope. Dang. I'm not sure, but it... I thought I heard the sound of, like, a armor knight. Okay, I thought I was just going crazy there. When I did, too. When, when the Pegasus jumped back. Jumped back, yeah. 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 <laughs> Has she always done that? I don't know. Is it because she's using a, using a sword? Maybe. I, like, did they scramble up the files? Or, like, audio files? For, I don't know. Hmm. Whatever. Stop going that way. Come to me. You're my experience. No. Give me experience, not them. Wait. What is that on the left? What do you mean? Oh. Above that archer now. Do they have their own Valkyrie? I swear to God, I think they do. Yeah, yeah, Jeffrey, be a show off. <laughs> not like I care or anything. Oh? Oh, are they going to join the ba the battle and that's why uh, they didn't let me take more than 11 people? Mm. Lucia, Bastion, are you sure you want to do this? The words of Ike ring yet on in my ears. We were so trapped by our own ideas that we were unable to sympathize with your feelings. I'm terribly sorry. Because the two of you will... Because the two of you think to put me above all else, you say you will sacrifice your lives for me. Yet, even if I'm able to borrow of Ike's strength and win back Crimea, if the cost of that victory is the lives of you two, is the lives of the two of you, I shall never smile again. And joy, never again would that emotion fill my heart. Princess Alencia, please aid Ike and rescue Jeffrey and the others. Then return to me. Come back alive. For you, we would the world itself depart. That's exactly what I don't want you to do. <laughs> we'll be back. I wish you would have just given me, you know, the option at the beginning and then I could choose not to take them. And you also use knives. Why? Wait. Huh. He doesn't have a weapon level in it. 
I don't think anyone does because it's in the that upper skill category. Huh. It's weird. Yeah. To I, me, anyway. I wonder if they changed that for the sequel, maybe? Hmm. Why do you have a Lugu's guard? I didn't know she came with one. Me neither. Also, I'd like to check. Jeffrey, what have you got? Brave Lance. And you have Paragon, too. Oh. Ah. Interesting. Oh, so yeah. you have Valkyrie? Valkyrie. Yeah. Hmm. With a physic. Ah. If only I could steal it. But I didn't even bring Soth anyways, so... It doesn't matter. Okay, ranges. Whoops, missed. That is not range. Activate! That's a lot of people. Oh yeah, that one already died. Because <laughs> it made the mistake of going after Ike. Okay, you could use a bit of healing, but that's a very dangerous area to have someone without a lot of defense in. Hmm. You can't even reach. Hmm. Let me see how much you could do, just in case. Yeah, your your accuracy is uh, very crummy. Hmm. How could you do? Almost. <laughs> Alright, so... Sword would be good against you, so let's just chop him up. A 1% chance of hitting for 3 damage. Jeez. Die, peon. Oh, I just realized I'm using the steel blade, not the steel sword. Oh, I, I think I gave the steel sword to Mist. Okay. Well then. What does more damage? Okay, the silver sword. Okay, so then I guess the seal blade would be better for now. Less wasteful, possibly. Hmm. I'm trying to think who I want to go first and who I want to do what. Wow, you won't kill him. But he won't do anything back. Be careful, he could, he could crit. For nothing. I wonder if I could have Mist go after that. Yeah. I mean, if you want to, I'm sure you could have Kieran um, use a hand axe on that mercenary. <laughs> I suppose that's true. Then again, there's still quite a bit of cavalry, so you'd want to make sure those are cleared out. I suppose. Um, here. Hmm, you have a short spear. Yeah, you could just kill that one outright. Does he need the short spear for that, or...? I guess not. Very well, go for it. Javelin tossing time. Dang. How hard would you have to throw a javelin to go th through a horse's neck and through the soldier on the horse? I don't know, but he did it. I also need to check specifically these ranges for uh, Jill. Dang. Okay, well, you could go to here, then. Yeah, that's enough. Hmm. Nice. You dead. Also, I never, um... <clears throat> Sorry. I never mentioned it, but I think there's an option that lets you um, switch between having all your battles in that cinematic mode. Yeah, and not. Yeah. I think you can even choose it for specific characters. Hmm. 
was just thinking, do I have more conversations? Okay, they can also talk to Ike, but it doesn't say that for Ike, which is weird. Hmm. But that would require Ike to backtrack, and I don't want to. You'll have to catch up with him. Here. It's like, well, I guess Ike's getting reinforcements, whether he likes it or not. And then, let me just check to see how it would do. Very unlikely to hit. But if he if he did hit, it would be perfect. But I do not trust that kind of yeah percentage. Therefore, all the ranges go back on, and let's play it safe. Well, you have 12 defense, you're fine. You have 8, though. So... Give you to Rolf, I guess. You're dead. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead. And stay that way. Okay, so it's pretty much the same either way, except you actually have better accuracy against him. Oh, because the... Well, I wonder if it's because he's using a javelin against him. Not sure. Or maybe bow users just have better avoidance, even if they're on a horse? It could just be the individual stats, possibly, hmm. of the actual unit. I could check that. Skill 9, skill 9, speed. He has one more speed. I don't know if that's the difference or not. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, I guess I should probably go after this one first. Probably. And you can just attack someone on the way. I don't think you really need the experience, but, uh... I don't think anyone else can reach to grab it, right? probably couldn't do it. You know? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure. What if... No, because there's that. Right. Okay. Then, never mind that. I could just move you further. I don't feel like I've made enough progress for this much time. I know. It's kind of weird. All right, talk. General Ike, allow me to apologize for my earlier remarks. I've got a selfish request. I have a selfish request, but I would like to join... Yeah, all right, fine. Now hurry up. Eh? If you've got time to apologize, you've got time to take out some enemies. Of course. To save my companions, I'll give my all. Fantastic. Now let's go. All right. Uh, yeah, sure. Watch her crit. Okay, now. Just a quick flyby. And get towards that frickin' ballista. All right. Uh, seven defense. So I do eleven. That would do a bit more. Hmm. I'm trying to think. So that'd be like fifteen and eleven. That's quite a lot. So yeah, I can't afford to have her in range yet, which is annoying. Hmm. Fine, just sit there. They probably won't even do anything, because she has shade and can hit back, but yeah. Gotta be safe. Yep. Ow. <laughs> okay, maybe this was a bad idea. I've changed my mind. 
Oh my god. Jeez. Well, he's not stealing any more experience. Mwahaha. I'm so cruel. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just imagine Lucina was like or wait. Lucia. Okay, I was gonna say, was it Lucia or Lucina? Wow, that did not do a lot. Huh. I was, I was gonna say it's funny to imagine Lucia. It's like, very well, for my companions I shall give my all. And then just a ballista bolt right in the face. Okay, she's weak. I mean, even if it is a land, still. Yeah, that's uh, not quite a good first impression. I need to check her stats. Ah, boy, she better not die. <laughs> or, oh, right, that's parody. Yeah. I'm sorry, I thought it was Vantage. <laughs> what would you use it for? That's why I was like, what? How does that help? Uh, silver Sword. Too bad, you miss. Get whacked twice. Jeez. Okay. Is it almost my turn now? Can I check what Lucia's stats are? First, baloney. Well, it is awkward. <laughs> oh, yeah, and then there's their turn. Maybe that's why it's taking so long. Have to wait for these guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, other phase. Get on with it. Yes, get on with it. Hmm. Jeez. It's weird seeing the AIs crit so much. Yeah. Do not abandon your post. Get back. Huh. No damage. Wow. Okay. Do, do you only have a longbow? <laughs> he might. Oh. Huh. Berserker. That's the first Berserker I've seen that doesn't have a name. Yeah. Okay, if I need to, I can just get to there. What's your ranges? Yeah, you have no range. <laughs> also, uh, real quick, check on Lucia. Yeah, what's... You have 10 defense. That's not great. Th Wait, what's Kieran's? 10. You have the same defense as someone literally 20 levels below you. Yeah, jeez. What the heck? <laughs> I feel a little bit less bad for Kieran now. Oh, that's a... Yeah, not what I wanted. Um, one damage. Well, that's a hand axe, so. Yeah. Iron axe. Your crit would be 30, so with the gamble it would be like 60? Yeah. Okay, I could work with that. But I should probably be safe. Let's check some other options first. Zero. But she hits twice. Has a crit chance of one. Alright, well I know Rolf could absolutely murder him if needed. Yeah. Okay, what could you do to this one? Only one. But I probably should have you heal people. Yeah. How's your health? That's not too bad still. All right. Probably need to end the episode pretty soon here. Yeah. Which is annoying. Ha, you have a sword, which means you're weak to this. Eat it. By the way, did we... Did we, um, debunk the fact that more weight means more weapon experience, or...? I don't know. Hmm. I guess it'd be kind of sad if that was untrue and I've been wasting all this time with the heavier weapons. All the money. 
Oh, well. It's not a waste for the heavy weapons. <laughs> All right, so I think we'll have to uh, leave this here for now, and we shall solve this mess next time. Goodbye for now. Goodbye.